What's up guys, Nepenthes here and welcome back to another FIFA 21 video. It is 6pm on Monday and um, there are some new SBCs. First of all, there is the odd one out SBC for a gold players pack. Uh, there is the Day of the Dead set, as you can see right here, El Catherine, uh, another kit set. For me personally, un unless you really love um, the cosmetics of this game and, and what EA have offered... I would steer clear of these. These are, these are just like um, like club clearers. These are like coin sinks. You know, it might only be like a couple K here or there per set. But if EA release like one a day or five a week or something, all of a sudden you're looking at like 10, 15 K a week. And before you know it, you know, 10 weeks down the line, you spent 100, 150 K on kits and badges that you can only use one of anyway. Uh, it's not really the greatest. Um, and then as you can see here, we've got the Sudamericana and Libertadores um, League SBCs. But it's it's bad it's it's bad um we've also got i don't think that new i think that newcomers challenge is still the old one as is the day of the dead so yeah you've got odd one out there with a tradable pack and the reason why it's bad guys um first of all there is no player as the group reward it is now a pack and as you can see there it is untradable it's only there for 30 days which is very very interesting um i don't know what their plans are with this um and as we uh, look a bit further into it, uh, it's very basically the same as last year, of course, for the Libertadores, you need the Libertadores players. I'll go and show you guys the differences between the um, Sudamericana and the uh, Libertadores in a second. Uh, and then the reward here is a small prime silver players pack, which is okay. A silver players pack, again, very akin to last year's, basically the same. A small Electrum players pack and an Electrum players pack. So some golds in here, but it's, I think Electrum players pack, I think is three three gold something like that um and then when you get to the round 16 you've got a prime mix players pack and then is where it gets just absolutely hideous the quarterfinals offers an untradeable gold players pack the semi-finals an untradeable prime electron players pack and the final an untradeable premium gold players pack with the uh, brazil section an untradeable mega pack um the fact that these are untradeable absolutely guts the whole purpose of the league sbc system and, and we were paranoid this year and last year that ea were going to do something to just further reduce the effectiveness of the league sbc grind last year the way that they did that is they started offering considerably more silver packs uh, and 5k gold packs and a lot less like super packs with with more cards in and then similarly for the sudamericana uh the final reward is a small rare gold players pack there's 12 segments in this one uh, the first stage is a small prime silver and a jumbo silver both tradable a silver players pack and a small prime tradable uh, a jumbo silver and a small prime silver both tradable uh, and then a small rare mixed players pack untradable like that's crazy it, all you get out of this is two rare golds two rare silvers and two rare bronzes and it's untradable it, it's just unnecessary a small prime electron players pack untradable another small rare mixed players pack untradable and a mixed players pack untradable do you know how like first of all how i, I don't understand like exchange a squad of Sudamericana players 11 11 the rating's a bit higher this one is a 67 rated do you understand that a mixed players pack is four gold four silver four bronze with just one rare how a small rare mixed players pack is like easier to accomplish than a, a mixed players pack i don't know uh, then you've got the final which is a premium mixed players pack untradeable and the final again which is a prime electron players pack untradeable and there's not even like an, a, a pack that is all golds, right? Which just blows my mind genuinely that these are untradeable. And then at the end of it, there is no player for the reward. So you can't even be like, okay, I'll take on the chin that half the packs are untradeable. All the silvers are tradable. There's a couple, couple of tradable like cards with golds in. And, and the trade-off is the fact that we get an 85 or an 86 or an 87 rated player that we can put into SBCs at the end of it. That trade-off would have been still frustrating, but better. The fact of the matter that they've made the rewards as untradeable packs, and for whatever reason, they're only there for 30 days. Oh, it's just... It has me on tilt. It's, it's very, very, very surprising. And my Twitter timeline... Uh, we are screwed, I think, lads. Looks like League SBC is going to be untradeable. Um, Unique Rigger says, uh, oh, wait, it's different for the other one. 83 plus rated for the Sud. I like this idea, even though I don't like the untradeable packs. What do you mean? Oh, wait, hold on. Wait, 
how can it say hold on i might be wrong here i might be wrong complete the challenges themed around combo bowl libertadores to earn a player rated 86 overall or higher complete the challenges themed around the combo ball sudamericana Sudamer to earn three players rated at 83 or higher Well, where the hell is where the hell is that reward set then? Because I can't see it. We we might be saved a little bit. It, like being untradeable is still mad frustrating. But where where is this extra content? What am I missing here? Is it in objectives? Daily objectives. There's nothing new in objectives. Oh. Oh no, Silver Stars is still there from, from last last time. Yeah, there's nothing new in objectives. Milestones. There's nothing new in milestones. He's in progress, obviously not, and teams obviously not. Where is the uh I d where do you get it from? If we go into the play section and then go back into SBCs. I am a little bit confused as to where EA haven't tweeted about it either. I, well, I, I literally can't see. Do you know what I'm going to do, guys? I'm going to go and complete the Conba Bowl. In, in fact, let me see if we can do it right here, right now. I've, I should have plenty of these players. Six Brazilian. We'll do that one last. Conba Bowl Libertadores players, 11. Um, let's go into our club. If I've got enough, oh, I don't even need to teach you guys the difference between the Libertadores and Sudamericana this year because of this, and this is brilliant, and you can see it there. The Libertadores is like the rare version of the card, and the Sudamericana is like the common version of the card. Um, do we have enough, essentially? Okay, I think we might. Let's... um. Let's use Squad Builder. Oh, you can't with Squad Builder. You can only do it on... Oh, yeah, you're frustrating. You really are. Um, all right, let's go back to Conmebol Libertadores. And let's go uh, goalkeepers to start with. Pop in the higher rated ones. Um, have we got any silvers, though? That's going to be the question because I know some of them require specifically silvers only. Um, I, I want to see what the... Uh, what the reward the 86 plus player is going to be i just i want to see it so we will do it right here right now okay he's silver we want to keep hold of him and then in a striker boom so this was 75 rated with 78 rated players 11 chemistry 95 boom premium gold players pack is untradeable it's mad frustrating it's one of the eight done um semi-finals team overall rating 74 this doesn't have a requirement fortunately as well of max silvers so we'll be able to use all golds here again um which is nice so let's go back into the libertadores let's go grab our goalkeepers um let's grab just defenders uh left back right back center back center back and then we'll pop another right back in there um and then we'll pop that guy there and this guy around there and then we'll go and get our three center mids um center mid cdm hopefully we've got enough silvers that's that's going to be the one that i'm going to struggle with uh we might have to go and buy some silvers and i, I just want to i just want to do it just to show you guys what it is I, I i'm very 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 intrigued to uh to see what the um what the 86 play plus player is going to be I, I don't know how to see it or or get it um if they could have shown it i would have just looked at it but alas here we are um, next up, we've got the quarterfinals. So this is, again, no silvers guaranteed. So these two are max silver. So we've got four that are max silver. I'm probably not going to have the silvers. Um, let me see if Footbin have got the players. Probably would have been easier to do in the first place, wouldn't it? Okay, so Footbin don't even have the players there. But what on earth, then, is the 86 rated player? Does it just guarantee out of the 15 out of the jumbo premium gold players pack does it just guarantee an 86 rated card maybe that's it um anyway let, let, let's carry on um 
Let's carry on. Conbo Libertadores. Goalkeeper up first. Again. Right, this is 4 4 2 this time. Right, we've got a right back. I don't think we have many centre backs. I don't I definitely don't have enough silvers. And I don't have any centre backs at all. Um so we're gonna struggle here to get the uh to get the silver teams done. I, I genuinely might just disappear for well, you guys will see me straight back. Um and then do it off uh, off video so that you guys don't have to sit here watching me because we are absolutely going to struggle with the uh with the silver stuff turn that one in um yeah I'm, I'm i'm too intrigued to see what it is to the point where i, I have to finish this off so i'm gonna go and finish this and i'll be right back all right guys welcome back um very weirdly ea just removed the league sbcs uh, I don't know if it's because the pack wasn't there. As you can see here, I was just uh, going through, uh, completing it. Um, and when I got to the end of this one here, we collected that. I had two more to do, the first stage and the second stage, and that was it. And then when I completed the um, the second stage there, at the very end, it said, uh, this SBC has expired, something, something, something. Um, so until EA put it back, uh, I don't really know what to do with that. Um, it's... It's a weird. I, I I think that they would have removed it because it didn't show as the reward, the eighty six plus pack and the other pack. And I just want to show you guys, um, unique riggers tweets because actually we can show you on the uh, footbin here. Uh, you'll see here it says complete challenges and earn an eighty six or overall higher rated player. And here to earn three players eighty three overall rated or higher. Um, so. I guess because that wasn't part of the reward, people uh, EA removed it to to change that and add that on. I think in general, um, th there's a lot of outrage about these league SBCs uh, because they're untradeable and because they're only there 30 days. And trust me, I do get it. Um, however, I think with an 86 plus pack and three eight, and an 83 three plus player pack. Um, what you can potentially get out of this, even though untradeable, is actually not terrible. Uh, it's not quite what I would have liked. I, I, I actually personally like the players. I like the player aspect of it. And I hope EA come back with that with the other league SBCs that aren't the Libertadores and Combo Bowl players. Um, obviously, I'm absolutely not a fan of the untradeable packs that were uh, that were available there. Um, you know, it, it stops these from being like, like last year, you could literally make profit every time guaranteed off the Combo Bowl, Libertadores and Sudamericana so easy just because of how cheap things were to buy and what you got back this year. That's probably not going to be the same in terms of liquid coins, but in terms of players, um, you know, in terms of like club stocking and, and, and getting more out of your club, it might not be impossible that you can still not make a profit, so to speak, but still do better. Um, so there, that's where we're at right now, guys. I mean, I, I built a couple of the packs there. I didn't manage to do the Brazil squad, so I didn't get the mega pack. We've got a silver pack, a gold players pack. I, I don't know which ones are on trade war or not. I, I've never understood why EA don't denote in the store which packs are untradeable and which aren't. Why not just say, you know, blah, 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 this pack, and then in brackets, if it's untradeable, just say, yeah untradeable it would probably save a lot of people a lot of hassle um so we've got a premium gold players pack as well from one of them of course this one is absolutely untradeable i think there's a couple of like the mixed player packs or the rare, rare like the electron pack or something like that um but yeah we'll be back um god knows probably tomorrow 6 p.m video we'll have a we'll revisit what ea have done here but the back end of this we should have yeah, see, this is what we got. So I think this Primex Players Pack is actually tradable, and a few of these other ones are tradable. But we're going to be uh, ending for... The oh, we got a walkout out of it. It's a blue one, so it's not going to be a proper one. Maybe it will still be. It's Polish. It's a goalkeeper, Chesney. I mean, if it is tradable, that'd be quite nice. Um, but uh, if it's untradable, it is tradable. Hey, well, there you go. I mean, we'll take an 87 Chesney. You don't, you don't mind it. For 20k return... Um, that really isn't bad. It, it almost pays for the entire league setup itself. And then we've got uh, another pre-order pack, a small Electron Players pack. I'll open these just to finish the video off. I might as well since I built them. So we don't even get a rare gold out of this one. This is just uh, the, a, a rare silver or a rare bronze. 
yeah, rare, well, no bronzes in there, of course. Only one rare, though, and that's why that's probably uh, tradable. Um, and then a Prime Electron Players pack, a premium... No, and, a, and the two Prime Electron Players packs and a Mixed Players pack, I think. Um, what do we get out of this one? No balls out of this one. Hilariously, though, I've had people tweeting me already, getting my like, icons and uh, massive cards out of these packs. So a tradable there again. Do you know what? We're gonna have to. We'll wait until we'll wait until the, the they're out properly and they're out. They're back out, and uh, we'll do a video having a breakdown when the market settles because people are playing stupid prices right now for um, these these Libertadores and Sudamericana cards. When the market settles, um, we'll take a look of the true cost of what it is versus the value, the minimum guaranteed value back of tradable packs, and just ignore untradable packs. Um, and we'll see what we can get to. But this guy is going to be the end of the video right here. If you did enjoy it, be sure to leave a like, rating, comment, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. For now, guys, I'm out. Peace.